Hi, and welcome to our newscast on Neanderthals. First off, I think I better warn you that you might learn something. Whoa. Okay, so in France, there's anthropologists in a cave, and they were digging, and they found Neanderthal remains. So guess what they did? They took them back to the lab, and they studied them, and they did all sorts of cool things, and then they put them in a DNA extractor and found out that there was about three billion letters in the DNA that they had right there, and that wasn't even all of it. So they started decoding, and it would probably take about seven years or so, but I think I might give you a demonstration. So, first off, we got to have a bone, or else you couldn't really do it. So we have a bone, and a DNA extractor. Yes, right there. So we open it up. Whoa! Put the bone in. Close it. Put the DNA extractor over here. We will proceed to push power on the DNA extractor. And then the DNA pops up on the screen and it's reading and reading and reading. And there is a lot of DNA. And it's reading. But what they have so far is that they were, the DNA with all they were um, probably red haired. Most of them, or a lot, and paler skin. It had something to do with the climate they lived in, all that cold and stuff like that. And they also found that, well, they, they may have also been able to talk, which was previously thought impossible. So they also, so they're all pumped up, they're like, yeah! We found some bones! And so all these people went out because it's really exciting and they started digging and they found more stuff and they found uh, Neanderthals with tools previously thought only be able to make by us, uh, Homo sapiens. And they were like, hmm. And then they kept going around and they found that they may have the evidence that they may have mated with the Homo sapiens and thus had those tools. And so there's that, and there was also things that you probably know, like the Neanderthals, they had burial ceremonies, and they could fight, they fought stuff, and they had to hunt, and, and all sorts of things, and they, they made clothes, and well, in the next portion of our uh, broadcast, right after the break, we'll, we'll show you some of that, like, actually show you some Neanderthals running around, all right. The Neanderthal man. Uh, now, let's think back. Now, today we know what to eat. You go into a restaurant or you go into your home and you say, what's for dinner? Let's have spaghetti. Let's have steak. Let's have uh, some meat, you know. Now, a caveman couldn't say that because he didn't know anything about eating meat. He didn't know anything. He was just out there, you know, just right out there. Hey, I am a caveman and I'm out here. You know, that kind of thing. Take two! Oh, I mean hoogly boogly. Other words take. Other words take. Other words take. Really? Uh, okay. Take two. So, guys, do you need more Did you time? Don't get it into the bucket. Guys, do you need more time? Why? Kind of. Is it, is it important? Yes, it's very yeah. important. Yeah. <laughs> 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 
Et ventre Take two <laughs> Take two I'm down my back Five minute coffee break <laughs> It's freaking freezing <laughs> Going on gangster with the holy mammoth hat here. <laughs> oh my god, it's freezing! And then, yeah. Take two! Hold on, I gotta get on set. <laughs> oh, I mean the deathbed, the deathbed. Don't. The ceremonial cinema digger! That one. Hold on. And. Take two! Good, go!